Are new here at nine o'clock. Parents and students speaking out tonight, calling for tighter security measures at Highland Park High School. And that push comes days after an incident involving a gun at the North Suburban Campus. WGN's Jenna Barnes is joining us live from Highland Park with the story tonight. Jenna. Ray and Lourdes, the student was able to bring a gun inside the school and then leave the building before being caught. The students and parents who spoke at tonight's school board meeting fear if there are not changes to security protocols here, it could happen again. Everyone was freaking out and everyone was just trying to keep each other calm. When I saw squad cars blaring sirens going that way, so I went that way too. Students and their parents recalling the fear they felt one week ago at Highland Park High School. After students returned from a planned walkout in memory of the July 4th parade shooting, the school went into lockdown. Our teacher, he was, he was really prepared. He had, like, had books and he's like, if anyone comes in, like throw them at the intruder. Police say a student brought a gun into the building. It was recovered off site and one person is now criminally charged in the case. But I feel like no action has been really taken. And I think that that's honestly disheartening and scary. The school board of District 113 now charged with figuring out how to make this community feel safer. They're scared to go to school. I'm scared to send them to school. And ever since the parade I have been advocating for metal detectors and armed guards. I feel like our children are sitting ducks. The district has armed school resource officers in each of its two high schools and board members say previous research has shown metal detectors aren't effective. We have to keep looking, we have to keep looking deeper. Still, they say no solution is off the table. If there was something to deter them from coming into the building with weapons, I feel like that would be so much better. We are dealing with a problem that shows up at our door. The origin of that problem is not at our door. It's outside our door. And that is really where the solution has to be. And then it took no action at tonight's meeting. The superintendent says the most important layer of security that they have is students bringing them information. That is what happened in this case. And the superintendent says it worked. We're live in Highland Park tonight. Jenna Barnes, WGN News.